tell me, when did you find out you were pregnant? Today. Today? Didn't you notice your belly growing? It grew right in plain sight. Isn't that abnormal? Relax. Uh, oh, boy. <laughs> Here's a lollipop. We'll check everything now. Uh-huh. All set. <gasps> there are fish in there. Oh, and flying bats. <laughs> well, it's clear. You are having a merpire. What? A merpire. A hybrid of a mermaid and a vampire. They grow very fast. That's why the belly appeared so suddenly. Then what do we do now? The same as everyone else. Take care of the mom and wait for the baby to be born. <laughs> <laughs> what? Feeling nauseous again? Yep, I can't eat anything, but I really wanna. Dang, you haven't had a bite in two days. Uh. Regular food doesn't cut it for our kiddo. They need something else. What smells so tasty? Uh, but that's bloody juice. It's for vampires only. Our kids have vampire. Well, how about it? Yummy. Bring more. All right. Is this, um, uh, ours? Yep. Our little girl, Eva. While I was getting out the bloody juice, you gave birth to her? Yep. Doc said merpires grow quick. <laughs> No way! Our little munchkin! Oh, she needs a crib! Ha! <laughs> I mashed up mermaid and vampire styles for our girl! She's gonna love it. And most important, kiddo, don't cause trouble at school. Okay, Mom. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, is this our Eva? Yep. <laughs> Hi, Dad. But you look like you're 16. <laughs> yep, I'm a fast grower. <laughs> That's why Eva is already heading to school. Come on, don't be late. All right. See you in the evening. <laughs> Bye for now. <gasps> Think she's going to join us at school? Totally. Did you see how mad Miss Gwen is? Jeez, we got enough problems. Now we've got this Murpire too. What a goofy name. I kind of like it. Nate. Nate! Hey, everyone. Hi. Hi. Hey, this is my desk. It's mine now. I'll get you for this. I'm half mermaid! My kin songs don't phase me, and I can do this. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you guys laughing? She might transform you all too. Let's see how this works on her. Ah! <laughs> What'd you say there? I can't transform back! Change me back! Sure thing. Wow, Eva's pretty cool. Yeah. Good morning, y'all. Hello, Hello Miss Gwen. Hey there. Nice to meet y'all. Mom's told me lots about you. Mm, I see. New kitty and cousin trouble, right? No, nope. no, she's, all, she's all good. All righty then. But I'll be keeping an eye on you. Now let's get this lesson rolling. Why the heck did Eva show up at our school? She's making us look bad. And she's got the guys interested too. Actually, I made them brew a potion. A potion? Yeah, it turned that troublemaker into a frog. With warts? Yep. <laughs> We'll see who ends up as a frog here. Is everything ready? Yep. 
Do we really have to frogify Eva? Absolutely! She needs to learn we're in charge, not her! Hand it over! Smells like the right one! Oh, oh no! <laughs> Alice! What have you done? <laughs> That's what you get for trying to mess with me. I'm cooler than all of you. <laughs> uh, Eva, what's going on here? She's still bothering you. Yeah, look! Um, brought a frog to school? Nope, that's Alice. Eva, you turned a classmate into a frog? Well, we wanted to turn Eva into one, but Alice accidentally spilled the potion on herself. Because Eva scared her! Enough of this, Eva. You're going to the underwater detention class right now. What? But you heard them! They started it first! They said it themselves! <gasps> Until you showed up, nobody wanted to do anything to each other. It's all because of you. Mm, that's not fair! It's all because you hate my parents, isn't it? That's enough! Off to detention class! <sighs> this is insane! There's nothing to do here, stupid teacher! I'll tell my mom and dad everything and still deal with her! Or maybe not. I'll handle it myself! How do you do this? Who's there? Oh, I found it! The one is gone. Awesome. Way better. Oops. What are you doing here? Oh, hi. Hi. I thought there was nobody here and I wanted to do my homework in peace. Oh, the teacher punished me and put me here. Darn. Now I'll get in trouble with her too. No, no, you won't. Let's get out of here. Uh oh. What's happening? Who turned off the water? Eva! Oh no! We're done for! Nope! Huh? Who's doing this? Turn off the water! I'll get my revenge! And now let's definitely scram! Wow! Nobody's ever pranked the teacher like that before! Aren't you afraid of a payback? <laughs> what can she do to me? Besides, now I have a witcher friend. A witcher? Me? Where'd you get that idea? Well, you're definitely not a vampire, and certainly not a merman, so you must be a witcher. Uh, honestly, I'm just a regular person. The only one in the family without any powers. Whoa, then why are you at a magical school? Well, my mom works here. I see. Well, who cares if you're ordinary? You're brave and clever. <laughs> Thanks. You're pretty cool, too. I've never met anyone like you before. <laughs> All right, it's time for me to head home. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> Goodbye. Hey, Mrs. Gwen. Hey there. We're thrilled that our daughter is studying with you. You're the best teacher. This is for you. Aww. What? You thought you could win me over with flowers? What are you talking about? <sighs> Your hybrid is causing chaos in the school. Eva, our merpire. <sighs> She's a nightmare. This creature is a mistake of nature. How dare you talk about our daughter like that? She turned a classmate into a frog on the first day, escaped from the detention class, and locked me in there! Eva could not have done such a thing! She's a good kid! Your merpire can't be good. You know what? Nobody insults my daughter like that! Find a better way to deal with the kids so they don't break the rules! This is wonderful. Yeah. Uh, hey, Mom and Dad. Uh, hey. Hi. How was your first day at school? It was okay. Some of my classmates tried to act all tough, but I showed them who's boss. 
Yeah, that's my girl. <laughs> uh, my bad. So, uh, how's your teacher Gwen? She's pretty mean. My classmates messed up, but she punished me. Are you sure you didn't do anything wrong? Nope. Then why did Gwen call us to the school and scold us? But I really didn't do anything wrong. Well, I did escape from the underwater class, but they put me there unfairly. Eva, Mrs. Gwen isn't just a teacher. She's a powerful witch. It's best not to mess with her. And now we have a problem with her because of you. Mm-hmm. Promise me you'll behave well at school, so our family won't have any more problems. I'll try, but only if she doesn't start piggy on me first. Eva! Uh, she's your copy. Ah, uh, a real rebel. Zach! All right, I'll zip it. Seriously? You called me to do potion homework? Nope. Something more interesting is going on. Sit tight. So we've got a plan to deal with Eva. Again? She doesn't bother us unless you provoke her. That's for now. Eva has more power than us. Yeah. Just think about what she could do to us. Ugh, scary. Better listen to them and agree. You know how girls can be. Quiet! We've decided to strip Eva of her powers. Here's the potion recipe and the incantations. Seashells from Triton's palace. <sighs> Bloody juice. Seaweed from Ursula's hair. A photo of the strongest vampire. And Gorgon water. Mermaid spirits, vampire sheets. Now you might claim the Marauder's power! Is it all done? We need to check it. It must work perfectly. We can't afford any mistakes. Come on, guys. What's wrong with you? We'll give you the antidote later. Ugh! You guys are such chickens! Mm, how is it? Are the powers gone? Let's check now. Oh! Ah! What's wrong with your face? Oh! Ah! 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 Eva will love this. Oh! <laughs> what do you think of this photo? <laughs> it's cringeworthy. <laughs> Is that Ariel, by the way? Yep. They wanted to brew a potion to strip you of your powers. But now Ariel looks like a monster. <laughs> Losers. <laughs> hey, are you free today? Uh, yeah. Do you have a suggestion? We could go to a cafe. Like a date? You could say that. What? Uh, I'll call you back. Uh, a date. Yes, mom, a date. What's the matter? I'm 16 now, and I have every right to go on dates with girls. Yes, but not with that snake. Eva is a merpire, and she's good. You just don't know her well. She's a freak of nature, a daughter of a vampire and a mermaid. You can't mix species. So what? I'm the only witch in the family without powers. Does that make me a freak of nature, too? No, you've misunderstood me. I understood you perfectly. What's taking you so long? Hurry up! Finding the antidote in these books isn't a walk in the park. It's not easy to look this way either. You pull it off. Maybe stick with it. I'll bite you. Oh, I found this potion. Are you sure that's the right potion? Who cares? Can it get worse? Exactly. Probably it can. What else? the shouting what's going on it's Ariel uh, what did you all mess up this time we well the girls wanted to strip Eva of her powers but we messed up the potion and this happened oh well uh, you're lucky I'm here it's me again Mrs. Gwen, maybe you could help us strip Gwen of her powers. Hmm, then maybe.
maybe she'll stop bothering my son. No, I might get fired from my teaching job. Well, Mrs. Gwen. Well, enough. Deal with Eva without me. Mmm, this is tasty. I didn't think you'd eat regular food. So you don't drink blood? I can. I don't care. I'm a merpire. I can eat anything. Cool. Hey, wanna go for a walk? It's so hot here. Hot? No problem. Watch this. I'll make some wind. That's enough! That's enough! Ah! Your tail is super strong! Indeed. Thanks to my vampire super speed, I can sweep half the city with my tail. <laughs> <laughs> wow, it's so cool. Your vampire qualities increase your mermaid strength and vice versa. Yep, I like it as well. I can also do this. Wow. Darn it, Eva's here. And with the teacher's son. What? Unbelievable! The teacher will flip! <laughs> I found her! What? Who? The witch who will help us with Eva! Seriously? You found a witch on Amazon? Yeah, kinda. Whatever, let's summon her. Whoa! Ah! Greetings, my devilish clients of a gloomy day! How may I assist you? We need to switch the merpire of her powers. Who? The daughter of a mermaid and a vampire! Ah! I get it! What you doing? Shh, quiet, quiet, quiet. And? Where did she disappear to? My phone disappeared too. And, and mine. mine! And all my money! She swindled us! You summoned her! I didn't know she was a scam artist! Tyler! Tyler. Ah, wait. wait! Zach, are you eating again? Yeah, I am. How can you eat so calmly when our daughter is going through a teenage rebellion? Ah! Give it back! Get lost! How dare you hiss at me! <sighs> Sorry. So what about Eva? Has she caused trouble uh, again? No, but she could. We need to do something about her. Uh, maybe we find her a hobby? What were you doing at her age? I was uh, going to school and dating you. Oh, that's it! Our daughter needs a boyfriend! Whoa! Whoa, a boyfriend? Uh, a good one. And preferably one we choose ourselves. A mermaid. Uh, or a vampire. Or maybe we introduce both, and she can choose for herself. Uh, super, let's do it. Uh, I found one! And I found one! Hey, who are you guys? Oh, where am I? Why am I captured? Quiet, quiet, just calm down. Uh. All right. Uh, I'm Zach, this is Tina. We're Eva's parents. Uh, we didn't harm her. Seriously, we didn't. It was all the girls doing. Uh, we even like Eva. Yeah, yeah, we like her. That's great. One of you will become her boyfriend. Boyfriend? Awesome! awesome. Wow, I'll have a merpire girlfriend. No, I'll have a merpire girlfriend. Easy, no fighting. Eva will choose one of you herself. So it's all in your, um, hands. She'll be home soon. Get ready to make a good impression on her. Be careful, sweetie. Here we go. Is there a surprise waiting? Oh, absolutely. Ta-da! Ta Tyler? Nate? Is this a surprise? Yep! Dad and I figured it's time for you to have a boyfriend! We have picked the coolest guys from your school! <laughs> I don't need them! Come on, dear! Just chat with them! Who knows? You might like one of them! <laughs> but… Mom and Dad won't steer you wrong! Just have a chat with the guys! Uh, well… Hello! Uh, hey! This is for you. Handsome, thanks. When did you manage to snag the bouquet? While well, you were hesitating. Uh, I've got something for you too. Uh, here. <clears throat> A pastry? <laughs> Actually, I whipped it up myself. You can eat both vampire and regular food. So here's a combo. 
A pastry with blood and jam. Mmm, cool. <laughs> Aren't you guys leaving? Nuh uh. We've liked you since day one. And this is our chance to make you like us. Um, all right. I get it. Mm. Uh, something's up. You okay? No! Uh, smell the flowers. It'll make you feel better. Achoo! Eva, you okay? Eva? Uh, I'll devour you! Uh! What did you do to the guys? Nothing. They just don't pass my test. Oh, all right, dear. Don't be upset. We'll find other guys. Uh, I don't need anyone. I have a boyfriend. A vampire? A merman? A human. Donnie. Uh, what? what? He's the son of the witch Gwen. <laughs> Donnie, the teacher's kid? Whatever. I still like him. Uh, are you nuts? We can't date humans, especially when those humans are Gwen's son. <gasps> Leave me alone. So, are we ready to go? Yep. Hold on. We're coming too. You didn't want to snitch on Eva. You had a crush on her? Not anymore. Let's go. <laughs> Come on in. What's up? Mrs. Gwen, we've got some really bad news for you. We know it's gonna be tough to hear, but you've gotta know. And it's good that you're sitting down. What happened? Your son is dating Eva. I know. You, you know? know? And you're not gonna do anything about it? <sighs> What's it to you? Whoa! <laughs> Eva has already driven me crazy! And now you guys, too. I'll handle her and my son myself, got it? Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> what are they writing over there? <gasps> oh, well, interesting. Eva can't date a regular human. Exactly. That's why I took action. What other steps did you take? Hey there, what's going on? Uh, I called Gwen to help us deal with our mutual problem. I suggest we send your daughter to a remote island in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. Gwen! What? Ever since she started dating my son, he's become uncontrollable. Eva too? So we need to separate them. Mm, I propose we join forces despite our differences to prevent a catastrophe. Fine, I've had enough of you. So you're not against teaming up to separate our children? Of course not. I'm willing to do this. Oh my goodness! What are we gonna do now? Uh, how could that Donnie guy even appeal to Eva? Mm, yeah, just an ordinary hey, guy. Are you upset that Eva wasn't punished or that she didn't pick you? Both, actually. Oh, it seems like we have no chance against the Murpire. Even the teacher does nothing about her. I think I know what to do. Donnie, it's time for lunch. Donnie! Did he run off to meet that monster again? Um, hello, Mrs. Gwen. What are you doing here? I came to see Donnie. We were supposed to meet, but he hasn't answered my calls or messages for two hours. Don't pretend you don't know where he is. You've hidden my son from me! Are you crazy? I didn't do anything! I've had enough of this! I'm calling your parents right now! Uh, we're already here! Where's Tina? Hold on! Uh, I'm here! What happened? Your little snake took my son and hid him! What? what? 
Eva, bring Donnie home immediately. But I'm not involved. I'm looking for it myself. Don't lie. We explicitly forbade you from seeing him. Why? Because it's against the rules? But you two got married against the rules, too. They prohibited you from being together as well. That's different. Oh, it's different. So it's okay for you, but if I fell in love, I am in the wrong? Don't you dare cling to Donnie. You'll ruin him. Who is ruining whom? If you you are ruining, are ruining us. Horrible. She is and a murderer. And we will make sure my school. Everybody What? They've gone crazy. Have I know where Donnie is. I know where Donnie is. You go ahead and try it. Why did you kidnap me? What do you want? Don't worry, we won't harm you. We just need your mom to think that Eva kidnapped you. And we'll pretend to have rescued you. But I'll tell her everything and you'll be in trouble. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We've brewed a potion of forgetfulness. You guys can't even brew a potion properly. They don't work. Darn, what if Donnie's right? Yeah, and we'll get in trouble with both Gwen and Eve. Are you guys chickening out? No, it's just common sense. Let's, Let's bail. bail! No, it's too late to back out! You're all in big trouble! <laughs> uh, we're definitely bailing now! <gasps> Eva! How did you find us? I texted! You guys messed up and didn't take my phone! Darn it! Nate was supposed to do that! What the heck? Why did you kidnap my boyfriend? We just wanted to teach you a lesson. <sighs> but we've changed our minds. You can take Donnie back. I'll take him back. But first, I'll deal with all of you. Ah! Ah! Wow. Wow. You can sing like that? I didn't expect it myself. I thought they'd just pass out. All right, let's get out of here. <laughs> you should tell your mom that you're okay and it wasn't me who hid you. What's the difference? They won't let us be together anyway. You're right. I don't get our parents. They're in the same boat as we are. Why are they against our relationship? Maybe we should just run away? Far away to the secret corner of the earth. They'll track us down there, too. Your parents and my mom keep saying that humans can't date magical creatures, uh, right? Mm, yeah. So I should become a magical creature, too. What are you getting at? You're half vampire, aren't you? You can turn me into a vampire with just one bite. But being a vampire isn't as cool as it seems. Are you sure? Eva, I love you. And I'm willing to do anything to be with you forever. I love you, too. It's all because of you. Now where can I find my son? He's nowhere to be found. My Eva's missing, too. This is all because of your Donnie. My Donnie is a good kid. My daughter is, too. Enough. Aren't you tired of fighting? Maybe we should look for the kids. Where? We've searched everywhere. Ah, uh, here we are. <gasps> my poor. Our, Our daughter! daughter. <gasps> uh, you look kind of strange. Uh, yeah. He looks just like me. Because I've become just like you, Mr. Zack. Uh, you, you vampire? Uh, Gwen! Oh, seriously, Eva, did you bite him? Yeah. She, she bit him! Eva! Vampires don't bite humans! You'll end up in jail! My little boy! He'll be a vampire forever! Why did you do this? Uh... Mom! Don't blame Eva! I asked her to! Why? Because she won't let us be together! We love each other and found a way! <gasps> oh, darn! Uh, uh... What a nightmare! What a nightmare! If only I knew you'd come up with something like this! And what would you have done? Allowed us to date? Yes, that's better than having a son who is a... vampire. We, we agree, agree too. too! Great! <laughs> that's what we wanted to hear! <laughs> oh wait, 
Uh, are those fangs not real? Nope! We wanted to show you what would happen if you didn't stop forbidding us to be together. So, are you willing to let us be together? Yes! Hooray! Yes. <gasps> <laughs> 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 for such pranks, I'll punish both of you! We'll, we'll back, back her up, up on that! that. <sighs> well... Here I am in the class again. Well, what matters is that we're together. Yeah. Listen, it's just the two of us here, for real. Consider it an unconventional underwater date. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, <okay>. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. Ugh. Honey, it smells like there's a dead rat in the fridge. Could you cook something? Of course! Cook this, Christy! Take this, Christy! Am I your servant? I need help, too! Help? You? Yeah, wake up! I've been trying to make you notice this for an hour now! Well, then you should… Don't you dare give me should! Everyone in this house is just thinking about music! Very well! I'm going to find myself a hobby! Mm-hmm! Dad! <laughs> look what I got! An invitation to a music contest! Why so spooky? Perfect, Nate! Let's throw everything on the floor! Isn't that right? Dad, don't listen to Mia! I found it! Girls, don't fight! The important thing is that you both have it! This is awesome, Mia! But I'm the one who found it! So cool! Competitions to think about while I carry everything on my shoulders! Mia, let's go prepare for the contest! Let's go! Uh, uh, don't forget me! Perfect! Clean this, Mom! Give me this, Mom! But no one wants to help Mom! I have to do everything in this house myself! Everything's on my shoulders! Okay… Well, no, that doesn't work! Yeah! This one is totally perfect! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> ah. Hey, pretty girl! What's the matter? Can't you see I'm busy? I want to offer you a dessert! How does it taste? Hey, are you out of your mind? What are you, crazy? I just wanted to flirt with you! I'm not interested in losers like you! Flirt with my sister! She's lame like you! Stop! Did I misunderstand? Did she just call me a loser? Unbelievable! Well, okay! Challenge accepted! Now I like her even more! <laughs> I'm entering this contest anyways! You'll see! <laughs> Alright, what do you think I should wear? Uh, this, maybe? No… This? Or this? Uh, no. Tina, what are you doing? I'm. Uh, well. Spit it out! You don't know how to lie! I'm. I'm choosing what to wear for the music contest. Well, who would have guessed it? The contest! Why not clean your room instead? Mom, it's already clean! This is what you call clean? That's it! My patience has run out! I'm grounding you! Mom! Why? I didn't do anything bad! Next week, you're going to help me in the kitchen! And no music! <laughs> Damn! But why? What about the contest? Mom doesn't care! My sister is mad at me! And Dad's even on her side! It's just not fair! <laughs> <laughs> but why have you grounded me, Mom? I don't understand. No one in this house loves me. No one wants to help me. What do I do to deserve this? <laughs> What's happening here? It's like you've escaped from a soap opera, the way you're sobbing. We're cutting onions. <laughs> You don't sob like that from onions, sis. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> what are you laughing at? You're also grounded for a week. <laughs> but then, what about the contest? There will be no contests. Go on. The onion isn't going to cut itself. <laughs> what have you done? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Would you stop yammering? Ridiculous. I don't want everything to be flooded in tears. Oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh. Hmm. Awesome. What ungrateful daughters I've raised. <laughs> Am I a bad mother? <laughs> Gosh, I'm tired. I think my eyes dried out from that onion. <laughs> because you're an idiot. My eyes don't hurt at all. Then why the cucumbers? Because I need to look my very best for the concert. But we're grounded! Ah! Why are you yelling? What are you doing on my side of the room? Aren't you in mine? Get out of here right now! Ah, <sighs> Zach, my idol. Someday I will see you. Ah, uh, it started. This autograph is the most precious thing I have. <laughs> the most precious thing, huh? <laughs> are you crazy? What are you doing? Well, I'm so sick of having a runny nose. Now I'll show you. <laughs> <laughs> now get ready! Don't touch my guitar, dummy! Get off of me! Wow, this song is really gonna take off! Now I'll upload it to TikTok! Hey guys, have you subscribed to Tim Tin's TikTok channel yet? See the link below the video! What? Just two likes? Mia and Tina? Well, of course. Mm. Nate, don't you have anything to do? Well, I uploaded a video with a new song, but no one has watched it. How much time can you spend on this nonsense? Where's your phone? Mm. <sighs> Dad, Mom isn't letting us go to the concert. Do something about it. <sighs> Who am I writing these songs for? Dad, what happened? I dreamed of becoming a popular singer. And what do I have now? Two whole likes. You, you have, have us. Uh, but what if nothing comes out of this contest? By the way, about the contest, Mom grounded us and isn't letting us go to it. No, that's not an option. You are going to the concert, and I will take care of your mom. And, and we'll help, we'll you, help get you get more, more likes. likes. My <laughs> daughters, I love you so much. <sighs> Uh, oh, you're suffocating me! <laughs> Another nice moment ruined. Uh. Hi, Chris. Can I borrow your telephone? The pretty girl returned. Time to reject her. Are you asking for a loser's telephone number? Chris, what are you talking about? I just need... Go ask Dylan. Maybe he isn't a loser like me. Ugh. Ah! Right, Dylan? What do you want? Money? This is all I have. <laughs> That's not really what I had in mind, but thanks. Ah! Hi, Dylan. What do you want? I don't have any more money. I need your phone. No, please. Anything but my phone. I saved up for it for two years. Oh, don't cry like a girl. I'm going to like my dad's video and give it back. Uh-huh. We're going farther! 
What is that screeching? My ears are bleeding. You'd better check it out fast. <laughs> what is that garbage? Hey, wait for me. I want to look too. We're going farther. And I love you. Dana, what are you doing here? Have you decided to turn the whole school deaf with your screeching? Oh, I guess I turned on the microphone by accident. Because of your mistake, my ears are curled up in a ball. Tina, I like how you sing. Keep going. Really? Don't you dare. Maybe you can sing for me on a date, or... <laughs> Very funny. She'll only go on a date with a picture of Zach. <laughs> are you really asking me out? Well, of course. I'm not Zach, but I'm not bad either. Of course I'll go. <laughs> what the heck is going on here? Ah! To be honest, I never would have imagined that my school crush would ask me on a date. Me neither. Uh, do you want to go to the movies? No, I like TV shows more. Wow, I would never have guessed. Uh, how about a cafe? Um, I'm on a diet. I need to make a call. Why are you on a diet? Oh, crap. I've put on a little weight. I just remembered that I have to do something with Dylan. But what about our date? Get up now and walk away with me. Walk where? I'm scared of you. Shut up and walk before you regret it. Okay, okay. We'll see each other another time. Bye. <sighs> see you. <sighs> Christy, since the girls aren't home, I wanted to talk to you. You should give them a chance. What chance? Mia and Tina should enter this contest and become famous. They're grounded. I didn't let you become a musician, and I won't let them either. Uh, what did you do? I've been hitting the dislike button under your videos for many years. And I've told producers that you're a talentless hack. What? I never expected you to betray me like this, Christy. And I never thought I'd have a husband who didn't care about me. Our daughters are going to that contest no matter what. As for you... Ugh. We'll see about that. I'll do anything to make sure you don't go to that stupid contest. Ah, what's this? Ow, it hurts so much. How am I going to go to the concert looking like this? Oh no! <laughs> yes! It worked! Okay, I think I managed to draw eyebrows on. I hope no one notices. Especially Chris. Listen up, dummy! Why did you lock me in the bathroom? I was stuck in there for two hours! What do you mean? That wasn't me! And why did you put scotch tape on my door? What scotch tape? Don't change the topic! Do you want me to fail the contest? How could you? Ah! Mia! It wasn't me! I promise! Mia! Me it alone. wasn't me! <laughs> Wait up! Wait up! Ugh! It really wasn't me who locked you in the bathroom. <laughs> and I really want to go to this contest. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? I think it's mom. She was always against this contest. Take me with you, please. What do you mean? Why would she do it? If you didn't do it, then who did? <laughs> How spooky. <laughs> okay, go blow your nose and we'll go. Ugh. We'll deal with mom later. Really? Thank you. <laughs> but we're gonna sing my song. Let's go. This is unbearable. 
Unbelievable! Leave the stage! That's oh, enough! Fuck. I'm fed up! You don't oh. have any talent! This is your fault, loser! I would have won on my own! Oh no, I've embarrassed myself in front of Chris again! Let's try singing my song! Why? Huh? <gasps> Dad! Dad! How long do I need to wait? Are you going to leave on your own or do you need help? We want to do one for our dad. Please. No, no, no go away! Go away! Come on, girls, I believe in you! Uh, okay, let's try. Give us another chance. Mm-hmm. <gasps> <laughs> bravo, yeah. bravo! That was remarkable. You're going to be international stars. You should have sung like that from the start. Those are my daughters, my girls. Well, I did say everything would work out. Say thanks to dad. If not for him, I would have never sung that. Whoa! Bravo! Bravo! Oh, bravo. <laughs> bravo. Yeah. Dad! Tina really is cool. I didn't notice before. Bravo! Bravo! Woohoo! <laughs> we won the contest! Yep, despite your attempts to sabotage us, Mom, although I had to sing some real nonsense. <laughs> that doesn't matter. What matters is that my girls will now be superstars! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Who gave you permission to go to that contest? I said you were grounded! <laughs> I knew you wouldn't be happy for us. Mom, you never understood us. We only asked for your support, but you... Next time, I'll shut the bathroom door with a chair. Mom! mom. Girls, go into your room and rehearse. I'll talk to your mom myself. There's nothing to talk about! I'll wait for you in the kitchen in five minutes. And who will clean it up? Take this chamomile tea, it should calm you down. I'm calm. Uh, drink up, drink up. Christy, you love our daughters, right? Of course I love them. What a stupid question. Uh, but loving parents should support their children in everything. But not in music! In everything, Christy. The girls have their first concert tomorrow. Let's go there together. I don't have time for that. I still have to pick up all the pieces from the floor. Uh. Can it be seven already? I want to see Tina. Um, but I thought you liked Mia. I thought so too. But I've come to my senses now. The concert's starting. Huh? <laughs> yeah! Yeah! This is our first concert! I'm so nervous! Calm down, sis! Everything's going to be cool! Uh, 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 oh no! What are we going to do? Sing! What else? La la! la. This is a disaster! Uh, let's get out of here! <gasps> Mom! Christy, you came! I thought about what you said and decided that this is important for our daughters. That's why I'm here. Thanks, darling. I knew that you would listen to me. Let's sing without the microphones. Good idea. Friends, the concert is starting. <laughs> Woohoo! Bravo! These are definitely my daughters, in clothes instead of diapers, but the style is the same. Woo! <laughs> Love Encore! you! Yeah! My girls! I need to think about how to use this opportunity. <laughs> I didn't think I could wait for you any longer. Everyone left a long time ago. Sorry, I was picking up the equipment. Tina, I wanted to tell you... I didn't like you at all before. Awesome. Just great. Then why did you ask me on a date? I wanted to make Mia jealous. I wondered why you ran away then. Now I get it. Good luck with Mia. Wait. 
I understood that you're the person I've been looking for my whole life. Why the sudden change? Because you're kind, honest, unbelievably talented, and so beautiful. Really? Really. Will you go on a date with me? I promise I won't run away this time. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me think about it. <laughs> <laughs> My darling daughters, I'm so proud of you. You did so well. Mom, why were you so against us being into music before? I was afraid of losing you. But why? We're your daughters and we will always be with you. Tina, Mia, you'll have to find out sooner or later. Nate, tell them. Find, find out what? what? Um, but, um, uh, I can't do it. I have to do everything myself. <sighs> Girls, we adopted you. What? Uh, hi everyone. Sorry for interrupting uh, family night. Zach, it can't be. I don't believe my eyes. If you're here to offer the girls a contract, this isn't the best moment. Uh, actually, I came to take my daughters. What? what? I'm the one who left the babies on your front porch 15 years ago. Now, girls, time to go home. No, these are our daughters. They aren't going anywhere. You've been my idol my whole life. And it turns out that you abandoned your children? Uh, I was building my career, and I didn't have anything to give you. But now, I'll make you even more popular! I'm not going anywhere with you! Ah, but you won't need anything. I promise to make up for the past. I'll go. I'm done with my failure of a dad, my mom who was always against music, and Tina who ruined my dream of becoming a rock star! Mia! Mia what, what, are what are you saying? saying? That I'm fed up! I don't forgive you for lying to me. Let's go, Zach. We still have a lot to do. You made the right choice, my darling daughter. Stay cool. <sighs> How could he abandon us? And then just come and take my sister away? <laughs> Tina, calm down. Mia will definitely come back. You'll see. What's going on over there? I'll see you later. Uh, you are no use at all. My ratings have gone way down because of you. But I, it's not my fault, I'm trying. Stop jabbering. I don't need a failure like you. You can go back to your family. Uh. Dad, wait. Hey, what's going on? He's not worth your tears. Tina, what are you doing here? I was just nearby and I happened to hear your conversation. <laughs> Tina, sis, what can I do now? I'm all alone now. <laughs> That's enough. Don't cry. Let's go home. <gasps> but our parents, they won't accept me. And you will never forgive me. <laughs> no, we love you very much. Dry your tears and we'll go. Our parents are already sick of waiting. Let's go. Mom, Dad, look who I brought home. Mia? I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Can I come back home? What happened? Did it turn out your new dad wasn't as cool as you thought? What difference does it make? You're ruining such a touching moment. <laughs> I miss this so much. <laughs> of course, Mia. This is your home. Come back. Thank you. I love you so much. Does that mean you're going to perform again? <gasps> yeah. <laughs> but no more real parents in our house. <laughs> <laughs>